Theory Level 1 Lesson 2. <clears throat> In this lesson we're going to talk about dark and bright sounds and the physical direction versus the musical di direction of the guitar. Dark and bright sounds uh, are something that uh, most people have some kind of word for, but the words might differ a bit. And uh, uh, we ask ourselves, what's the difference between this pitch and this pitch? And I think most people will agree that there is a difference. And my, word, my words to describe this difference is that this pitch is darker than this pitch, which is brighter. A consequence of this is that as you move from string to string downwards, the pitch gets brighter. And this is the source of some confusion when it comes to the guitar, because when, from a musical perspective, when we, um, when we move from a dark sound towards a brighter sound, we say that the pitch goes upwards. So as your hand moves downwards, the pitch goes upwards. So from a physical perspective, down is of course down towards the floor. But from a musical perspective, this is up. And in this course I have decided that when it comes to motion from string to string, I will refer to the physical direction. When I say tell you to move something down one string, it's down towards the floor. Uh, but if we um, take a look at the fretboard, we also find that as we fret from the head towards the body, and uh, the pitch moves upwards, the pitch gets brighter. The higher the fret number, the brighter the pitch. However, if you look at the angle of my guitar, as I fret towards, from head towards the body, my hand moves downwards, sl slightly, but it's most often a downwards motion. Uh, when it comes to the fretboard, uh, I refer, I will use the musical direction. When I, say, when I say move upwards on the fretboard, it's towards the body. That's the convention I'm going to use, and uh, in the challenges from now on, I will uh, use this terminology. 